Alrighty guys, welcome back to Ark, where today we're getting the first 100 runes on Fjordor. So yeah, now I do got all these written down for the first ones. Uh, I just went off of Ross Clark's, I just messed up his name, Ross Clark's video. And we are going to go start over on the volcano like he did. Now I do got Gunner here with me. I also brought Blossom along for them tighter to reach places. Now our first one here is going to be at 75, 78. I'm going to try and show you guys all of them. You know, me getting them all. But uh, I might cut off big chunks just because, you know, time. I don't want to have a 40. I can, I'll go with a 40 minute episode. I don't want an hour and 20 minute episode though, you know. Also, it just got hot as balls. I, yeah, I probably should keep my pants on at least. I think I see my first one. There it is. Can I pick you up on the dyno? Yep, I can get them on the dinos. Nice. Now on to the next one. Alright, here's our next one. Did I get it? So I gotta hop off. There we go. There's the second one. Alright, here is number three. It's a little tricky to spot. It's up here at the top of the waterfall. Get you on the, get this one on the butt. Yep, got that one on the butt. Okay, I just got the seventh rune. I'm deciding to just do this real quick. Because these ones are a little bit trickier to find. I just landed on that one. Yeah. I just got the seventh one. I guess I'll come back to you guys here once I have the tenth. Okay, just got the tenth one. Now, the last one was down there in the Wyvern Trench. I don't know if there's any more down there, though. Okay. Just got the twentieth rune, and it is down in here in the Magma Swords. I just wanted to say something real quick. I honestly, these things look amazing. And I can't wait until we get to tame those. So, that's why I'm going to spoil it. So, these three episodes for this week. Um, yeah, they're going to be the only three episodes for this week. And we're going to start back up with the normal five next week. And then that five should be us basically getting ready to kill Rockwell. That's basically what they're going to be. I'm just giving you guys a heads up now. Okay, so I'm just realizing that I'm kind of getting a lot of these. I'm not doing them much. Just kind of getting them. I'm not recording much at all. So, I don't know really what to do. I, like, it, because, like, just flying places and trying to talk with how big of gaps there are between these, it's, like, it's weird. But we're 25. That's 25 runes so far. So, I think, yeah, that, well, we might be good on time. I might be able to make a 15 minute video. And that was the last rune on, what is this part called? I want to say like, the volcano. Yeah, the volcano. So, uh, I think I need to find out how to get to the space cave. I got Gunner cryoed. Uh, he started floating up. Now, I need to eat. Hopefully, I can just... Are you serious? There's nothing for me to walk on. I see our first rune though. Here, get the coordinates popped up for you. This should be 28. Boom, that's 28. Can I eat here? Oh yes I can. Just chow on that. Now, it seems like I can legit just fly in here. So I might not even need gunner or I, I don't have cheats on, right? No, no cheats. Okay, this is legit how this works. This is awesome. So I, I just float over. Oh my god, this is disorienting. Whoa. So what, I just follow this. But uh, this is—is is this what the space biomes like in like Genesis? I mean, I remember. Uh, Genesis 2, when I pl play tested it, when it first came out, you could, uh, 
there was like a space part and every now and again asteroids would be in there and you could float around like this I believe but it was a lot slower it felt like also where is my next one hold up I just paused and unpaused this oh it's like the aberrant aberration zone um i hope this actually isn't like where the aberrant stuff spawns because i could not deal with uh what are they right now reapers no reapers please okay here's the second one for the space biome boom what's this this is gonna be like wham smack on the ground because the gravity kicks in no no this is awesome is my my next rune has to be out here right i feel like it's out here i would so build a house here This just looks awesome. Um, but I don't see a room. And my GPS coordinates are not lining up. That's why. There's the door over there. It was on the other side of the room. So it was like completely. But yeah. Okay. So I've been thinking about this. If I ever do do a server. I might do Fjordor, if anything. You know, I might do Fjordor, come bring all my stuff on here and do it for the hammer, you know? And this would be like the, my location. I'd invite all of my guys to live with you, with me. I probably would have to do Patreon, honestly, to even afford a server for you guys to play on. So, if I do do a server, don't be, don't be mad that it's paylocked behind Patreon, but yeah. Like, there's a bunch of those rooms around, I just was looking. Anyways, I should probably get back on to getting the runes. You know what? This also gives me a really good excuse to explore the map of Yordor. I'm just saying. It does, because I would never have been in the swamp. But there's actually like even a castle up there. I just got the one from up there. Now I need to find the next one. Like, like look. There's a legit little village right here where the next one was. It's awesome. There's even a, like, a prop dead stego. And there's also a Spino just ripping shit. Okay. We're done with the swamp. Now, I need to figure out how to... Teleport. Is that something I do here? Realm teleport. Okay. Uh, Varnal. Vanal high. What am I doing? Fuck. There is a leech stuck right in the middle of my screen. Fuck. We're teleporting to East Vanaheim. There's leeches on me. Legit, there's one stuck in the middle of my screen. Fuck. Is there one stuck to my face? Um. It's froze. Oh! We kind of crash landed. Okay. Okay. You're disabled here. Kill all the leeches on you. Did my leech disappear? It looks like it did. Okay. Need more meat. Now. It shouldn't be too hard. We have Blossom. Now she can help us get around. How far am I from my... Not far at all. Okay, that one makes 43. 
Alrighty. This is 50. We're halfway there. And now that one should be the last one for this biome. I think I go to Asgard now. Okay, we are teleporting to North Asgard. Um, is there supposed to be red flashes in the teleport? Is it broken? Are we going? Are we going to a bad place? Like it looks like it's glitching. Are you not a good? Ah! I yep. Yeah. It's probably not going to allow me to ride Blossom here. I might have to swap back to. Hopefully I can swap back to Gunner, actually, instead of running around Blossom. Blossom there in Vanelheim was a little bit of a pain. There we go. Can I ride you? Yep, I can ride you. Okay. Can I ride you? Nope. Now, I don't know what spawns here. What, what, why am I stuck? Okay, there we go. Problem solved. Now I need to go and find all the runes for Asgard. Alrighty, and here is the last one for Asgard under this green tree. Boom! And it's 69. Okay, now I'm going to get my milk on my hotbar. We're going to pop one now, and we're going to go pop over to the last... The last place that we need to go, which is Jotunheim. Or, well, not the last place we need to go. The last dimension we need to go. And we're just going to go pop up here in the north. I'm not even going to go hop on the back of a... Uh... Oh, I really hope I can ride Gunner in. I feel like I can ride Gunner in here. I remember... I think I remember it when I went and got the Fenrir. Did I use was i allowed a flyer i'm a i think i was allowed a flyer here i hope i'm allowed a flyer here yeah uh i must have changed something in my settings here where it's not allowing me to ride flyers and caves and out out in stuff like this because i bet this counts as a cave Okay, guys, now we got the last Explorer Notes here. That's the four. That's 84 now. We are almost done. I need to teleport to Vardy Land. Let's just go. God damn it. Teleport Vardy Land. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, my God. This has been so scary on this. I've been, I've been trying not to record because I'm just keep screaming. I've been trying to run and get these done as fast as I can. This one here was the one I wanted to get done the fastest, just because I had, like, a limited supply of milk. Please. Okay, and we are back on Vardy Land. Now we're going to cryo you up. You don't have to be on my hotbar anymore. And you can come out of your cryopod finally. Alrighty, I just got 90. That means we have 10 more to go. Alright, that's 96. 97. 98. Here is 99. And there is 100 runes. Got a max plus 5 levels. Let's go. Alright, is that... Alright, we got first 100 runes, that means... Okay, okay. That That's 100, right? Yeah, that's 100! Nice! Now, that's probably going to be it for this episode. I'm going to have to go and write down more of the notes. Because I only wrote down the first 100 of their GPS locations. And that was kind of probably dumb. It's really hard to figure out where the caves and all that are because i i've been looking up caves like on videos on how to get them i mean this is taking me four hours to do to get fought with the first 100 so yeah i'm gonna write those down i will continue on and yeah i just need to get a screenshot now. <laughs>